Hey Stampers, welcome to another week of Watch It Weekly Wednesday. I'm Beth, part of the Stamping Jill creative team, and I am here to show you some really fun, simple ideas that can get you prepared for the holiday season. We have, at Stampin' Up!, some of these wonderful Memories and More card packs. Now, I think the number one intention for these card packs is to do scrapbooking, which is like we use the pocketbook scrapbooking mode, but I'm not a huge scrapbooker. I really love to use these card packs to make greeting cards. You can take these beautiful card packs and you can make so many greeting cards very quick and very simply. And Stampin' Up! makes this very easy with a bunch of coordinating products that all work, it together, work together and make it really easy for you to make a lot of cards quickly. I'm showing today the Wonder of the Season suite of products. There is the Wonder of the Season card pack. It comes here with these smaller cards and they're, they're repeated. So there are a bunch of the same ones, which is nice. You can make a bunch of the same cards, but they're also double sided. So you've got another option on the other side. It comes also with a larger four by six piece here. And again, there's multiple of them. They have this beautiful gold foil accent and the ones who, that don't have gold foil are double sided as well. So you can use either side of those. Really, really cute. Stampin' Up! also has Wonder of the Season memories and more cards and envelopes. These are larger cards and envelopes and they have this beautiful red foil accent on the cards and the envelopes themselves. It's kind of a little frame there to work with the memories and more card pack. I'm also going to be using today the Wonder of the Season ribbon combo pack. It has this really pretty shaded spruce wide ribbon and then it's got this gold trim that comes along with it too. They're really fun to work together because they're so different. And that's all I'm going to use to make a bunch of cards to get me ready to send out Christmas cards this year. I feel like of all the years, this is the year to send Christmas cards. And I want to send them to a lot of people, so I'm going to do it in a way that I can make them as quickly and as inexpensive as possible. Okay, I'm going to start with this card here. It's the most wonderful time of the year. Love. Now, I want you to notice something. All of my layering here there's a lot of dimension to it, if you can see that. Something that I also feel is essential for these Memories and More cards is Stampin' Dimensionals. If you don't have these, this is such a great basic to have. We use these, I think, in the office more than any other product that we have, maybe besides Whisper White cardstock. But it just gives your project that bit of pop. It just makes it complete. And it doesn't add a lot of bulk, so it's easy to mail these with Stampin' Dimensionals on them. So I'm gonna pull in the pieces that I need here for this card. I've got my card that I'm gonna work on. This one is so fun because it's gonna fit my Memories and More card right here inside that frame. And it's just gonna frame it with that red foil just perfectly. I'm gonna bring in my sticker sheets here. I want this saying right here. It just pops right off of there. I'm going to add, even though this is adhesive on the back, I'm going to add dimensionals to this because I want it to pop off of the paper and give it just that much more dimension. Something to remember with these is that they are sticky on the back, so they'll try to grab your project. So you want to use a few dimensionals to pop it up so that you don't have to worry about it um, unevenly sticking to your paper. I'm going to peel those off and put it down here on my little card, just like that it down there and then I'm going to add my little jingle bells here and I'm going to add just a little dimensional to the back of my jingle bells and put those on just like that and you have multiples of these stickers to be able to use it really is very quick to come up with these cards and they just take such a short time to assemble but they've got that really pretty wow factor with the red foil accents and the gold foil accents on some of the sheets I'll show you another one of those and then I've got my ribbon here that I'm going to put right behind that. And very quickly, I've got a beautiful card. Let me show you this again. That's what it looks like. And you've got that beautiful envelope to send it in with that pretty accent. 
so quick and easy. I wanted to show you one more card that we've come up with. I love this one because it really shows off that gold foil accent. This one is one of the larger 4x6 Memories and More cards. So it's going to cover up that red foil on the Memories and More cards and envelopes, but I still think it's really pretty and I think it's okay to cover that up. Let me pull in my pieces here, just a few pieces. I'm gonna first take my ribbon and tie it around this foil piece, just in a knot. This ribbon has a great weight to it and it's actually really easy to tie. Quick and simple, just like that. I'm gonna trim it just so it's a little bit shorter here. And then I'm going to adhere that down to my card base. Just using some Stampin' Seal. No dimensionals for that bottom layer. Now these cards are made to give you just a little frame right around that card base. Just like that. So pretty. Now I'm going to take this card and I'm going to add it. This is one of the smaller cards from the pack. I'm going to add it with some Stampin' Dimensionals. Now I like to put four, one on each corner and then one right in the middle just to keep it from sinking down in the middle. Peel off that little layer. I'm going to add that just right there. And I'm going to take Sending You Christmas Wishes. Again, this is a sticker back, but I want to pop it up with some dimensionals. So I'm going to add a few just to keep it from sticking to the paper. And I'm going to pull off these dimensionals on the back here and add my saying, my sentiment, just right onto my Christmas tree there. Sending you Christmas wishes. So quick and simple. Got your card and your coordinating envelope. Love it. So with just these few products, you can come up with a bunch of cards and get them ready to send out to your family and friends for the holidays. I'm confident that you could easily come up with your cards, but if you feel like you need a little bit of help, we do have a PDF that's available for download at stampingjill.com that you can get to have some inspiration and make your cards even quicker. The Wonder of the Seasons Memories and More Card Pack is so full of product. We have split this video into two parts showing you some cards that you can make that I just shared, but Aubrey also has come up with an advent calendar using the rest of the card pack. So make sure you check out that video so that you can use your card pack to the full extent. If you need to purchase any of these products to make these awesome cards and advent calendar, please visit us at stampingjill.com and you can click the link to shop there. If you have any questions, please let us know and thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next week for another Watch a Weekly Wednesday.